I'm Daniel Dorr. I'm the Senior Director of Marketing for our PowerSchools eFinance Plus solution, and I'm joined today by Wes Durham from our services team. Wes, thanks for joining us. Oh, thank you, Dan. Wes, we've had a lot of customers thinking about whether they should be upgrading, and I know you and your team manage that upgrade process and have done so for districts across the country. We wanted to talk a little bit about is like what that process is like for, for customers and districts. Um, and the first time when you talk to districts, why are you finding they upgrade in the first place? Like, why are they doing this? I think this slide really articulates a lot of the key reasons. First off is there's a lot of really great new functionality that's available in our ERP software. A lot of enhancements, a lot of really great things that allow us to uh, operate more efficiently. So there's really great um, ways to handle those remote operations. Uh, better support is, is also a key component of that. Um, staying up to date on the latest and greatest allows the support team to better support you um, with all of the most recent updates. We also have monthly update packs that occur. So we're consistently and constantly working on uh, bug fixes, enhancements, all kinds of different things with the software. So uh, being on the newer iterations of our software allow you to receive those monthly updates and you can stay current even on a monthly basis. And it's just easier to adapt and adopt all the new uh, functionality that's available in eFinance Plus by uh, staying aligned that way. So it's not even just about better functionality, it's actually about making it easier for you to manage and maintain uh, a really integrated finance, HR and payroll environment. Correct, and you also have the ability to receive any changes, updates and fixes in a much more efficient manner with those monthly updates. Fantastic. And what does that process look like then for uh, districts that choose to upgrade? Yeah, so a, a typical upgrade would start with your account representative uh, working through the, the sales process. And what they'll do is they'll help build an appropriate package for your district um, for all of the different aspects that we'll need to cover. So, you know, whether that's uh, we need to look into hosting or we need to look into um, server configuration or specific customizations, whatever those needs are, we do some analysis up front and help you come up with the right upgrade solution. Mm -hmm. From there, we would then go to the custom retrofit and that's where the product tailoring team at PowerSchool will work through the actual process of getting those customs lined up and ready to go in the newer iteration of the software. So we may update the code, we'll make sure that everything is functioning and working with all the newest iterations of the software. After that, we'll then actually install your test system. And what that'll do is allow us to install the most recent version of the software for you. And we can begin then the testing and training process in your current environment. After that, we then begin the training process. And that's where the professional services team from PowerSchool will take you through all of the new features, all of the new enhancements, and, and really deep dive into all of the different functionality that's available to you in the newer iterations of the software. The training will be focused depending on what version of the software you're coming from and what version you're going to. So it'll be catered appropriately um, and, and aligned for your operations, however your organization is set up. And then you'll see there, there's, there's a long amount of testing time. The reason we set it that way is we provide you with a extensive list of different things that we would recommend to go through, review and test. When it comes to ERP, Dan, we understand that we, you know, payroll can't fail. We have to make sure that AP checks are being cut, those POs and all the procurement things are moving through. So it's really critical that we test all of those processes and make sure that everything is going um, as we would expect. So. Um, that's it's a partnership when it comes to the client testing, but you know we'll work with you and help make sure and guide you along that path to make sure your testing is good. And then the final step would be the installation of your production environment, where we'll take you live on the software. So, a couple months from end to end, but uh, there's a lot of different breaks and steps along the way in the upgrade in the upgrade process. Wes, you had a lot of training in there, um, and. Do they really need that much training? If you've been on a prior version, you've been working with PowerSchool for years, why would you even need so much training? There's new functionality that the, the software offers, and we've had a lot of uh, front-end and back-end redesign of the software to really enhance and make it more efficient and operational. 
Um, a good example for is we have the ability now, something called Optio Forms Manager, where customers now can change a, a check signature, for example, or make minor adjustments to their check. We want to make sure you understand those new procedures and processes and make sure you're empowered to utilize the software in the best way possible and then work with PowerSchool on the things you need. So we really encourage you to understand all the new features and functionality because it can increase your business operation efficiency. Sounds great. Wes, thank you so much and appreciate all your help. If you've been okay. interested in talking about an upgrade, feel free to reach out to your sales rep. Thanks, Wes. Thank you.